weeks and I'm from Los Angeles. When I started writing the first like 10 years, I, I kept it so private that I wasn't really around really like-minded people. So I wasn't meeting other artists, I wasn't collaborating, I was just writing, I was like totally in my own mind. And then I went to London, that was my first trip that I took for music. I was working with um, Silva, Sohn, and Pete, and I wrote a lot of meaningful songs within such a short period of time. It was like two and a half weeks or something. It was the first time I really like opened up around other humans that kind of thought the same way I did, and, and I felt different ever since then. I remember I had just worked with Teed, and I was taking the subway back to where I was staying, and I had like this banana that I was eating, and I was completely content, just like on the subway alone, eating my banana in London. I was nourishing myself with food, and I had just nourished my mind with music and with another artist. My first real show was in London. It was just kind of like a secret show, and then a month later was my second show with The Weeknd. So I was really nervous. I felt kind of like a, an untamed animal on stage. If you see videos of my early stuff, I was kind of like a Tasmanian devil or something. Like, <laughs> I feel like I've, I've grown and I can hone my kind of, my lion in a little bit. It's just, stage is, is really cool because your mind is just quiet. You have to block out every negative thought, every fear, every... It's just like you tune everything out and it's just you and, and the words that you wrote. You just dive into it. What am I most passionate about other than music and writing music? Friendships and lovers and people, I would say. Yeah, the most special experiences I've had, the most touching experiences I've had through you know, my phone number, being public. I don't even tell. They, it's like people share such intimate things. I feel honored that people trust me, trust me. I just always think if I was able to text Fiona Apple when I was 15 and she texted me back, it's like such an incredible thing to be able to do and it's like human contact. That's what's real and so I love it.